Alright, hold there, people. It's Lord Volkart. And what we're about to do is a story for me. Because, well, it's official. This might be complete. Which is Project uh, well, Obsidian. Obsidian Fire. That's what I've been calling it. Uh, got a nice sleep. So, Obsidian Fire might be officially done. And, uh, means a lot to me that it could possibly be finished. Now, update this one. We have only a few token pieces. We're going to make sure port it in and we're going to go ahead and leave it where it needs to go. Which would be great. We're really close to just plugging the damn thing in. I am just really close to plugging the damn thing in. Which means a lot to me uh, to finally be so damn close. We're going to use the TV so you guys can see it. When she comes on. This is why you have a six foot cord, people. Uh, would be a lot safer if I'd done better post test for this. So I feel a lot less stressed at this moment. Oh, good. Twitch decided not to work. Hold on. Uh huh. Gotcha. You gotta love when Twitch doesn't want to ro load itself. But everything else is fine. That's good. Now we go over here. We click dashboard. We hide. We turn off uh, playing because we're not playing anything. We update that. So this is Lord Volgar here. Dashboard. And this might be official. We have very little in between us right now. You see me moving back and forth. But the last step to do is bring in the power cable. Oh, let's go the metal back on. Oh, there it is. I'll put the front grill back on. Guys, I don't know if that's actually safe to do because there's a lot of metal. If there's an electrical discharge, there's a lot of metal to do with. Uh, we got a surge vector here, guys, and we are ready to roll. Everything else. Yeah, it's definitely surge vector in. The power is about to be there. The last thing we're going to do is pull from the motherboard box. The last thing I need to pull from the motherboard box. Get what it is. Let's get in there and find out. So, pull from this box. I'm going to test it. I know that, and I just can't remember if it was live me before. I didn't want to start it without doing one thing.
We are so close to doing a post test, it is insane. Uh, do a couple post tests, do a little play around. If she didn't explode, that's a complete possibility, it might just die. Screw around in the post. We do not have a Windows, a uh, legitimate version of Windows right now. So, hey, welcome to the room. What's up, buddy? Yeah, we don't have a legitimate version of Windows. So, we can do a post test, but that's about it. And it catches me off. And uh, where's the one? Ah, there's Motherboard manual. It's really important to your motherboard. Is it manual? Manual. Oh, okay. If this little shitty keyboard that, you know, if everything dies, I really don't want it to be something that fits in this and kill. So the other keyboard is not over here. keyboard. Oh, let me check one thing also, guys. fun. Uh, message these guys. I'm pretty much be back despite that. Alright. Okay, guys. The last bit of this unholy construction is taking so damn long. Oh, look. What's up? Oh, well. Yeah, hold on. I can see that link. Oh, yeah. You got to make sure we send people links. Excuse me. Got part of this. Groovy. So, we're about to have a buddy of mine in here, and uh, he's going to hang out for a minute. I can't believe I screwed up not putting this in today. But, hey. Caught myself, but not censored in. And oh, stupid. We're still going to need the post test, and not too long because I'll have to use five and censored in the spot. On board, Ellie. Oh, yeah. Glory to the non-believer. Yes. Glory to the non-believer. This fellow is a very good, a very good point. Glory to the fucking non-believer. I've got to put the sensors in for the heat, so let's, you know, do that. I like the light. It is too bright, man. I'm sorry. Again. Uh, let's see where those sensors are. There's one right there. Be really quick. Ish. Can't believe I screwed up that part. Uh, there's some heat diffusion sensors that I totally forgot about to put in the damn thing. So we're gonna do that before we do anything else. Uh, the scissors. One, two, one is all the way down here in the bottom, on the top right, and found it. Very small living node sensors. No, 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 
Uh, they're plug and play wires. Let's see if we can get that in the plug and play wires. So this it's gonna be fine. I did not screw this up that bad. Oh, that's really long fish tape. Oh shit. Pin one, which is I'm assuming. It's a horrible. Yes. Uh, it makes a lot of sense. The pin one is supposed to be. I'm assuming facing toward the back is what it's trying to tell me. Okay, that's the pin one right there. Shit. Oh, yeah, positive and negative. Woo! Put that down to the bottom there. There are three little sensors on this damn thing that are, you know, some. By the way, cord linked. I mean, that's the length of my arm. So you can really wound this into the damn ball of this thing. And uh here's the other one. This is the same setup, right? The ground is the other one. Uh, the one that is positive is the one with the little oh well then after this over. Good that I looked at that before I plug that in and uh you know, go off like a bomb. You have to hold a flashlight with your main hand. Try to fit all this shit in here. This is fun. And, uh, the cable space. Oh, yeah. Uh, fucking miss the other pin. Uh,. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's right. Uh, we're going to run that one up here near the hard drive. So we're going to run it through that little hole. Across over here. And uh, that should be good. And... Hey, man. Yeah, dude. Isn't that, you know, totally screwed up? Awesome. Yeah, I have this thing... Like, totally ready to fucking go. This one's facing down, so the pin facing down to the bottom. It's just the last inevitable piece of. There we go. Need that pretty. We're going to fit this right between. Nope, we're not going to fit it between the fans because I didn't speak of intelligence. I'm going to bring this down the bottom. We'll cable wire that fucker in later. I didn't tie the slack down, so when I started it up, fix slack for me. Yeah, I know. Uh, and kind of monitoring all the extra cables have been spread as far as wide as I can. Uh, the CPU fan's right up here, yeah, and I decided to put that across the bridge for the sensor. I'm going to really try to figure a way to, like, I might just use some electrical tape and jam that up there uh, eventually, which <coughs> looks like an easy route to do. All right. By the way, this is a closed loop water cooling, guys. Uh, Stuart had to change his, I mean, Lord Volcar had to change his plans and uh, do some, you know, easy buying and found it publicly in store. Uh, Altex, guys, that's why I did the review for Altex. That shit rocked. That place rocked. Uh, he even dropped the price for me, so. Another shout out to the Altex guy, man. 
for the store and the manager is a very decent dude. Uh, really got to go in there one day and just like shoot the shit with them because they are some awesome bunch of people, uh, human beings and everything else. What time is it? Uh, 12.30. Why, were you supposed to be sleeping? Or you, you got an early morning because, dude, I, I'm I'm uh, three to ten tomorrow. That's right, I work, people. Uh, but it won't take long because I'm about to just screw it. I'm not gonna put the Wi-Fi thing in right now. Let's go ahead and push the power button. Who wants to push the power button? Pushing the power button. Let's turn these back on the screen. Oh, cool, man. No, I have a time delay on my uh, display. Major time delay. Okay, ready? We're going to... Oh, shit. All right. Yeah. yeah, let's push the power button. We fucking forgot the cord. Fingers crossed. Yeah, uh, the power cord's not plugged in. I'm so excited. I fucking forgot the power cord. Ha, 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 Oh, shit. Uh Fire extinguisher is closed in this room. So, if it happens, if it happens, but, you know, they're sorry to prepare for this and this eventuality. Power is on the bottom. Oh, it's official. The start button is on. Okay. I'm pushing the power. Holy shit! Okay. All right, we didn't have a post. Uh, we're having some cellular lights here. No, it is not smoking. But we are having some cellular lights in here, so... uh We had a failure to post, uh, which is likelihood. Oh, shit. Well, as far as I can tell, nothing's exploded and flicking flying, so I mean, that's some good shit. Uh, but we had a failure to post. Uh, the fans came on for a moment. I've got a D6, so we're going to find a D6 code. D6, no console alpha device was found. No console alpha, what? The freaking USB is on. USB plugged in. Okay. The back fan's still running. So, hmm, I turned it off, uh, and it is still alive, so, huh. Well, technically, yeah, it might be the prongs of the motherboard. It's not smoking, so technically, we had a slight post failure. And let's do this again. I'm going to turn this off. Power in the bottom before we get the fuck in this case. Oh, wow. Uh, this is awesome. So let's look at... You made a good point. It might just be straight to the prongs for the connection. Or... A little bit more poking in. Oh, yeah. Pull this from the electrical source. By the way, guys, let me pull off the electrical cord before I fucking dig in this. Oh, yeah, and... uh Let's 
see some safety instead of some stupid. Jesus. All the way around. Okay, so got looks like it's firmly seated, so let's unseat it for the power of the graphics card, which is a lower end graphics card, but it's a decent graphics card. Use graphics card and the reason we're using the used graphics card is sure it's not gonna blow the money yet on the same graphics card. Same thing as a pain in the ass. Oh, yeah, it's screwed in, so that's, you know, good to know. So that's screwed in, but. Let's see it in there, so. Change of power as well. Let's plug in this one instead of the other. And we're not going to close it when we do this post test again because. Now, before we have to get back in it, so, hmm, so those power switch again. I'm not going to turn you to the TV yet, uh, so let's see if we can't. Oh, well, it might help if you had the fucking power down at the bottom on. Okay. Okay. So that might help. All right. Push the internal start button. You know, little red light. You guys can't see it. Again, we have a failure to post. Shit. <laughs> oh, wait. It's on the screen. Oh, fuck yes, it did it. <laughs> Victory. Oh, God, the amount of time this is taking to do all this shit. Wow. And everything is active, you know? Oh, yeah, it's letting me go through the BIOS. Everything is officially active. The so monitoring temperature-wise, the arm temperature sensors are on. Uh, we got CPU speed. Let's see if... We need main, so I need main so I can connect and make sure, not security. Uh, we've got uh, internal speed system. That's running under the, lead, under the below, but uh, we'll fix that later. System language, system date. You know what, we don't really, you know. Wow, that's pretty much damn accurate. Uh, that's got 605 2015. Hey, how the fuck does it have this day? All right, so mm -hmm. BMW was hey, thank you. I got congratulations. Oh, God. So wait, is the person that said what the fuck, is that um you, my friend? Of uh of of uh plants? Let's just go with that so we don't, you know, share off the internet to the people that don't want to be shared on the internet. And Jim or not, you're you're awesome. Jim or not, you're awesome. Uh wow. It's nice to know this thing actually works. I'm looking at the memory. Ah, wow. 
see. So we've got memory voltage. If you, yeah, the core voltage. I'm feeling really that everything here is definitely working. Um. Oh, yeah, I should be talking. All right, I've got another. Wow. Oh, okay, you let him know? That's cool, man. Really is. Ah, uh, what in the fuck am I gonna do now? <laughs> Kidding. Uh, total memory. Let's say in three hundred and twenty-seven oh megabytes. That's only reading the uh, hmm, terabyte drive or the solid the hybrid drive. But hey, it's hosted with CE. Let's see what CE means. I don't know what CE means. Except for my postcode, handy dandy postcode notebook right over here. CE. -E. A. E. C. -E. Wow, this is wasn't the first time, got it the second time. That is a CU, right? Yeah, that's a CU. So what the hell is a CU? There is no CU. That's helpful. Codes don't go to C, so there must be. Hmm. Give this in the front panel, it says something about the digital area display status. Or the code. I don't have a C E on here. Oh, well, there's some numbers in there. The CD reserved for future AM area code. Hmm. So in other words, it could just be a blank code it's throwing me. Groovy. You see for future error codes again. All right, so we've got a lot of reference for future error codes. Um. Temperature-wise, everything looks about fine. It's running at 26 with the fans on it right now. Monitor. So the motherboard temperature is actually 29 degrees. All up to 84 BRM temperature. Uh, sensor one and two. Oh, wow, they're really fucking cold down there at the bottom. Now, I still don't have the fans that the chassis fan speed not available. Yeah, that's, those ones are not available. These two, though, are running on RPM listing. Uh, so why are these ones? Oh, Chaz Fan A. So these are under RPM listing, so. All right, so what's up with this? What do I have to Chaz Fan A? Okay. Maybe these are just not running. GPU core voltage. Yep. 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 I'm just saying, yep, guys. 
uh, I am just, you know, skirt around to see what, yeah, I can see. Uh, boot. Boot. Fat boot. No, 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 no. Let's not do fat boot. Yeah. In case we still gotta fix some stuff. Network stat driver. This piece of work. Boobog. Play F1. Alright, in trap respond. Table. Setup mode. Dance mode. Secure boots. Option one, we got multimeter tab. Okay. Boot option two, there's only two boot options. That's shitty. Priority, hard drive, priority. So we got both hard drives are listed on this. All right, so that's both hard drives are directly listed on that. So we got CD, yeah, it's hard drive, yes, priority. Okay. The hard drive's working. So that's uh, one down, or at least worried about things. Let's see if we can't find the RAM listing. We need to find the RAM and make sure that's running. For some reason, one of these fans are not running. Uh, not the top fan. Top fan, back fan, working. Uh, front fans are working. That's one, two, three, four. And the two of the fans right now are the only ones that are actually PMW, so I don't know why. Uh, these are listening for the RPMs. But they are. Those are all working. And the light up in the front's working. Reset button probably works. Oh wow. The panel's on. Uh yeah, I'm I'm walking through the steps just to see. I mean it's Microsoft. I uh, just have to get a legitimate form of Microsoft and I'm gonna use uh Linux as well. But I want to put Microsoft first on this, and then Linux right after that. Which is, I'm going to use an Ubuntu uh, form of Linux, so it's still going to have the rollover click buttons and everything else. Another thing to check is your USB ports whenever you get it running. Yeah, um, the front USB ports are not running for the USB 2s, but the USB 3s are working. Uh, I know that because I have them plugged in. <laughs> wow, that's just confirmation right there, man. I know that because I have them plugged in. But, uh, I mean, they're at least operating in standard. And the other one won't show because I'm actually waiting for a few other parts uh, to get in. And I will discuss that even live so I can give people a definition of what parts are coming to me and uh, what is going to work on this system. What I really want to find, oh, my favorite, it's not there, main. Let's see if we can't find, now we found the speed, total memory. Now I'm seeing a, that's not ramp. That's not ramp. Pretty, wait, wait. Okay, so CPU turbo mode. So IU over fucking tuner is auto. We're gonna leave those alone right now. And uh, we're gonna leave that alone because that's gonna be later when we actually have a freaking operating system this fucker that I can go back underneath here and screw around with it uh, for that. The back port, the USBs are working right now. I'm waiting to get a connector. USB configuration. Let's see. Configuration. Mark audio. Take USB devices. Uh, it's the four hub right now. Uh, so that's, yeah, that's at least letting me know the back hub is working. 
Yeah. Legacy support enabled and everything else, so. But where the fuck is the RAM? There should be a RAM listing. Ooh, CPU fan profile. What's that? What is the turbo button? Let's see what the hell the turbo does. Oh, yeah, I forgot. These are not BMW enabled fans. Which, oh, Ruby. Uh, for me. You fan control auto. Let's keep that in all out. Let's put this back on standard. There you go. That's standard. We're going to give up standard mode. Control. Um, you chassis fan source. Oh, CPU chassis fan source. Thank you, one. Uh, let's see if we can't. PC mode. These are reading out the fan connected right now. Let's leave the anti surge off so we don't have surging fans right now. So, this is monitoring set. This gives me temperatures for the scales of monitoring. Uh, the chassis fan actually is running a different RPM every so often. That's nice. Food bug tools, but you post. So it's definitely reading the DVO, DVO that is connected, um, which is nice to know already when your graphics card is already running. Right, guys? Woo! When your graphics card is already pretty running on this yet. Uh, I want to exit yet. Oops, tools. Tools. Uh, my favorite main, the main. RG version. No, I won't have to be updating the same thing. Which is flashing the motherboard, I do not have to do. I am glad about that because that sound annoying as shit. Alright, so the frequency is below the level that the uh, RAM would run, DRAM frequency, auto. All right, but there's no one of the DRAM timing controller. That looks like. All right, so we got DRAM case latency. Here we go. Got an auto under these settings for all of this. DRAM. Delay, 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 Hello. Hmm. Really noticed you didn't have a RAM listing that I can see in the front part of the page. Nope, there we go. Uh, we're not going to fuck with this yet. Oh, but I still want to. Okay, so stream tweaker, um, A button, A button, cancel, we're not going to exit yet. So what can I say? Other than we got it to boot, we definitely know it's running. Uh, we recommend installing graphics card onto PCM1 slash the best performance of your graphics card when you use the following according to the number of graphics cards you want to install. Oh, and I can turn off the graphics card slot with an actual switch on the internal of this motherboard. Do, you know, that can happen anytime. And I can turn off the extra, you know, open port so I can actually get this guy to run a lot better. A lot better. All right. Well, I'm going to be playing with this tomorrow. It's like late as hell. So I'm definitely going to be playing with this tomorrow. Uh, but before I even think about turning the hell off, let's, let's get a camera image of what's actually inside this case. Or, you know, at least 
the way it looks now when it's on. Okay, you're gonna move. Flying camera. Flying camera. All right. All right, hold on. Here, just far enough to get back in and uh, adjust it. Adjust it. There you go. So this is active, and uh, the two hard drives are up there. They're they're posting through. Uh, I can't see the RAM listing right now. Uh, if I had an actual mouse plugged in to let you guys know, mouse operates on the fucking motherboard. So bloody awesome that a mouse will react on the motherboard instead of just having to go through the keyboard would make it a lot more easier if I had hooked up a mouse. The reason I didn't hook up a mouse is because I was kind of, you know, not sure this would post right. Uh, you can actually see the Corsair sign is glowing pretty damn brightly in the case. Uh, so I really didn't need any more LEDs. I got the other one LED on there. Start button is probably going in the corner with right below the uh, switch switch. Everything's running. The fans are running great. Uh, still got two more fans that I can technically put in here. I don't want to do them tonight, uh, but wow. It is alive. And it took a long time to even get close to this, you know, living living uh, case or running case and everything else. Uh, don't touch the feet. Don't touch the feet. Here we go. Oh, God, that, that's bright ass light. Let me turn off that light. So, oh, it is with us. Switch. There we go. That's a bright ass light. Uh, wow. Now, he makes a good point. We could test the USB, and I'm going to test the USB in one way that actually will make it a little bit more fun. I'm pulling from my... The light came on. <gasps> Holy crap! Holy crap, Spackle, guys. Wow. So we can do this from English. Uh, let's go ahead and cancel. I'll my favorite. Huh. Oh, this is the fan control set. Turbo full speed. Just run full speed. Oh, full speed at the... Uh, fly. We hit apply. Under manual. Okay, let's start this case. It's weird to be able to use a mouse on this. I'm never gonna lie about that. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we finally got that to come up. You would need a mouse to run this motherboard. Okay, so let me. You know this page. I had a failure on the uh, Twitch page and my chat went off. So sorry, guys. Wow. OC and Brad. Uh, wow. This is definitely showing up through everything here. Uh, we were getting some decent pull in the air. So, you know, this is live. Right now, there is no doubt in my mind that this thing is working. Okay, so I guess everybody left the room or it reset. Thank you guys for adding. For adding me. Oh, I guess. Man, 
say, do you want to raid me? Nope, let's get out of that.
really don't know what to say other than that. So the post test is going through. Uh, I got to see the Rams on. Um, the fans are reading for their RPMs, even though they are not PMW fans. So that's something I did not know that we were going to go down. And as much as I saw the complaints about, oh, PMW is the only reading fans for uh, reading fans. And they run up here on this front panel piece. You, you can probably barely see it, uh, but there's a front panel piece that is running a CPU 32, 32 degrees. Mac and we'll set up the proprietary the temperature requirements for even that. I have a fucking huge mess I'm gonna have to go through and that doesn't even mean that I'm, you know, almost done, but I mean at least I got it to boot. Which for me is saying a lot of happiness. There's been a lot of effort put into this. Uh a lot of effort. Okay, so that's the fan control. When I hit turbo, it's, it's turbo mode. Summit mode. Drop it all the way down to the bottom. We get stable. Standard. We're going to stick at standard for now. There's nothing else I can do, guys. The last components will be the Windows programming that will go in here. And I have a faked out version of Windows programming, but it failed. So there's nothing else I can do until I get a legitimate Windows programming. Um, who knows how long that will take. But I can officially say that this computer posted, it is put together right enough. <laughs> put, put together right enough that I would call this you know, work in progress. This progress is extremely, you know, efficiently you know, on on the board. Um, this has taken a very long time, very, very long time to uh, get finished. But hey, I didn't blow my bank. And uh, Bullshit, that's not just 10 minutes running. Oh, did it shut off for a minute? It probably did. Okay, guys. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here, open broadcaster. Thank you for watching. Uh, it was official. It is posted. And one, uh, not one post, but, you know, two posts. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. What is more badass than that?